How can a model with just 7 million parameters beat giants with over 600 billion? Samsung's brand new TRM tiny recursive model just did exactly that, outsmarting both DeepSeek and Google's Gemini. Sounds unbelievable? Let's unpack how this tiny powerhouse is rewriting the rules of AI. What exactly is TRM? TRM, tiny recursive model, built by Samsung's AI lab in Montreal, thinks in loops, rechecking its work for smarter answers. It's shockingly small, with just 7 million parameters, compared to DeepSeek R1's 670 billion. Yet this pocket-sized model outperforms AI giants in reasoning, redefining what small but smart truly means. So how does something this small beat the giants? The secret lies in its recursive reasoning process, a self-correcting loop that helps it think step-by-step step instead of making quick guesses. Rather than stopping after one output, TRM goes through a three-step cycle, draft, think, and revise. It writes an initial guess, reanalyzes it internally with hidden notes, and then revises the answer to make it more accurate. This isn't a one-time thing either. It can repeat this loop up to 16 times before finalizing an answer. Each round helps it reason better, fix earlier mistakes, and refine the result. Instead of growing bigger and heavier, TRM just gets smarter by rethinking its own work. That's something very few large-scale models actually do. The excitement around TRM isn't just because it's new, it's because it's challenging the bigger is better mindset that has ruled AI for years. Most tech companies focus on size, bigger models, more GPUs, more power. But Samsung has just shown that architecture matters more than scale. By designing something efficient and clever, Samsung proved a small, focused model can outperform billion parameter giants. This shift could change how AI development moves forward. Less about massive servers, more about smarter design. And it's sparking a conversation across the tech world about what intelligence really means in machines. Samsung put TRM through several tough reasoning tests. Things like Sudoku puzzles, mazes, and abstract pattern recognition. These tests are designed to check how well an AI can reason logically, not just memorize or guess based on data it's seen before. The results? TRM outperformed nearly every big name. It scored 45% on ARCAGI1, compared to 37% for Gemini, 2.5 Pro, and only 15.8% for DeepSeek R1. It also hit 87.4% on Sudoku Extreme and 85.3% on MazeHard, beating much larger models by wide margins. Considering TRM has less than 0.01% the size of those giants, this is nothing short of remarkable, a true example of quality over quantity. Unlike most AI models that stack layers like skyscrapers, TRM builds depth through recursion, reusing the same layers and loops to learn and self-correct. This design makes it faster, more efficient, and far less power-hungry than massive models. In simple terms, one smart brain cell beats a thousand careless ones, making TRM perfect for small, on-device AI. For such a small model, training had to be smart. Samsung used data augmentation, meaning each puzzle or reasoning task was shown to the model in many different variations. This way, TRM learned core logic rather than memorizing patterns. For instance, Sudoku puzzles were reshuffled a thousand times, mazes were flipped and rotated, and reasoning tasks were recolored and shifted. The model was trained using the Atom W Optimizer to control learning speed smoothly and exponential moving average EMA to keep training stable. And here's what makes it even cooler. All of this was trained on regular GPUs like NVIDIA L40S and H100. Each benchmark finished in under three days, proving you don't need a data center to train something powerful. This isn't just about one model doing well. It's about a new phase in AI TRM shows that intelligence can be designed, not just scaled up. It means performance doesn't have to depend on thousands of GPUs or billions of parameters anymore. 
Now, even small labs or startups could build models capable of high-level reasoning using affordable setups. It also opens doors for local AI where advanced reasoning could run directly on devices, phones, tablets, even home robots, without relying on cloud servers. That means more privacy, faster responses, and far less energy use. TRM may only have two layers, but its recursive process gives it the power of a 42-layer deep network. That's because each loop adds depth and refinement to its thinking process. So even though it looks small on paper, it acts like a much deeper model when solving problems. Interestingly, when Samsung tried using four layers instead of two, the results actually got worse. The smaller, simpler design worked better, proof that complexity isn't always an advantage. In some cases, TRM even replaced its attention mechanism with a simpler MLP mixer, improving accuracy on reasoning tasks like Sudoku. Less code, better results. One of TRM's biggest wins is that Samsung made it open source. The full code, training data, and even configuration details are available under Samsung SAIT Montreal on GitHub. That means anyone, from students to indie researchers, can experiment with it, learn from it, and even build their own improved versions. This is a huge contrast to big models like Gemini or DeepSeek, which are completely closed. By making TRM public, Samsung is promoting transparency and faster progress in AI research. It's a move that benefits not just companies, but the entire global AI community. TRM stunned the AI world with benchmark wins. 87.4% on Sudoku Extreme, 85.3% on MazeHard, and 45% on ARC AGI-1, beating even Google's Gemini. All that power comes from just 7 million parameters, small enough to run on a mid-range laptop. Its recursive design proves that structured reasoning doesn't need scale to succeed. For businesses, it's proof that smaller models can be smarter, cheaper, and faster. TRM shows the future of AI is efficient, local, and accessible to everyone. TRM makes AI more eco-friendly and affordable, enabling smart devices to run advanced reasoning locally without the cloud. It marks a turning point in AI, breaking the old rule that more parameters mean more power. By proving clever recursion can beat brute force, Samsung opened the door to micro models handling reasoning, while larger ones focus on creativity. The message is clear. It's not about being big, it's about being smart. TRM now leads in structured reasoning. Faster, cheaper, and greener than its rivals. Next up, a possible TRM2 and a wave of recursive, compact AI models inspired by this breakthrough. If this trend continues, we could see a new category of AI models emerge. Small, efficient, and self-correcting. Models that don't just process data, but truly think, looping through their thoughts the way humans do. TRM may be tiny, but it just might have started something huge. Samsung's tiny recursive model isn't just another research project. It's a wake-up call to the entire AI industry. With only 7 million parameters, it managed to outperform models nearly 100,000 times larger. That's not just impressive, and it's revolutionary. It shows that the future of AI might not belong to whoever has the biggest model, but to whoever designs the smartest one. So, what do you think? Is this the start of a new AI era where tiny models rule? Or will the big ones fight back with new tricks of their own? Drop thoughts down below. This one's going to be fun to watch unfold. We hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel.